Hi guys and welcome to TechBase. In this video, we're going to talk about the latest Windows 11 Insider preview build for the dev channel, which is the build 26120.1330 for version 24H2. And in this video, as always, we're going to cover everything that is new, the changes, the fixes, and all that. So stay tuned for that in this video. If you enjoy videos like these, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. So let's begin with the video. As in other Insider channels, Microsoft is expanding the rollout for for the new file explorer feature which basically allows you to duplicate a tab so you can just right click on a tab and then click on duplicate so for example if i'm in the pictures folder i can just right click duplicate and it's going to duplicate this location and this could be a useful feature for the times when you're using a lot of files and a lot of file explorer windows related to narrator microsoft made several changes to improve the performance of narrator scan mode this is expected to make scan mode responsive much quicker especially while using microsoft edge and reading through large documents and you can try out scan mode if you turn on narrator and then turn the scan mode on by pressing caps lock plus the space bar. Microsoft is also beginning to roll out the new changes inside system and then power and battery and here inside power mode we're going to be able to expand this section. This is not yet rolled out for me but you can see that in action in the previous video that I've done. Basically that will allow you to change the way the power mode works depending on if you are plugged in or on battery with your laptop. Also if you go to system and then for developers and you have the end task option enabled, we're going to notice that whenever you are ending a task, you will no longer see a not responding dialog to give confirmation before ending the task. I think that is good. And also Microsoft updated system info to now follow your text size preference under settings, accessibility, and then text size. And we also have a fix in this build related to settings. Microsoft fixed an issue where the Windows update page in settings was not displaying correctly for insiders using certain languages with no text shown. If you are impacted by this on the previous build, updating to this build should still happen on its own. However, you may still need to wait a little bit. There are also a few known issues that you may need to know. For example, the BitLocker recovers screen issue may also impact Windows Insiders in the dev channel. And also Microsoft is investigating an issue related to the performance tab in the task manager, causing graphs to not show the correct colors when using dark mode again. So this is pretty much all there is to it to the dev channel. I'm gonna make sure to make a different video about the beta channel because we have there a few new interesting things. So if you enjoy these videos and this video, of course, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Emmanuel from TechBase. Until next time, have a nice day.